girl it's monday it's actually 7 45 at night i got home from work and i filmed the video i filmed the mac and tiana taylor collection i wanted to show you guys on the vlog what it looks like it looks so good but definitely go check out the video on my channel it's already live so i'll have it linked below so you can see their full tutorial because it looks so good i have in some new extensions i got clipping extensions i love being able to switch up my hair but i hate committing to a certain style so i feel like with clip-ins i don't have to commit i could take them off and on and i just feel like it's just a great way to easily change up my style without wearing a wig which you guys know me and wigs are like we're not friends okay yeah wigs jacked up my hairline and i just don't know how i feel about going back to them right now so we're not doing wigs for now um i just wanted to show you guys this look and i also wanted to show you guys a couple of packages that i just got today in the mail and i figured i would show you share that with you for this little section because this is going to be a weekly vlog i decided it's going to be just a weekly vlog going to vlog my entire week because i started work so i'm not going to have so much time to do day in the life but weekly vlog I can definitely do so let me show you guys what i got in the mail I got the sigma 16 millimeter lens that one is going to go on this camera right here and this is going to be like my in-between camera my last package is in this box so i'm going to just open it with you guys because i didn't open it yet so this is what i got and i don't know if you guys have seen this on instagram but i feel like it's all over my instagram feed and basically it is a hair tool it is called mermaid hair and it's to create big bouncy waves instantly. You can see the type of wave it's gonna give you and I cannot wait to do this to my hair. This is what the tool, so this is what the tool looks like. You guys may not know this, but I used to be obsessed with the hair waver that I had and it's pretty old, it's not really that good anymore. But they kept stalking me with this particular one in all my ads, I kept seeing it. So I decided to finally pick it up and I cannot wait to use this. I'm gonna definitely wave my hair over the weekend and um, I maybe I'll do, maybe I'll show you guys a tutorial, I don't know. This is the cutest pink tool ever. I'm obsessed with pink, so this is right up my alley. Like, I love this, you guys. That was my little unboxing. Um, I already showed you guys the lens, which I already have on my camera, and the hair, which I'm already wearing. I got all these items today in the mail, which I knew they were coming. Tomorrow is Wednesday, and I have my juices coming in, my detox juices. So I'm really excited about that because I definitely need to go on a deep detox cleanse. I'm getting ready to do my nails because they look so horrible. This is one here and then exhibit A. They look so bad. So I need to take this polish off. Yeah, my hands are mad ashy. I have all my polishes here. I'm gonna use this color. This is the polish I'm gonna use today. It's like a see-through pinkish shade, really cute. This hand looks tragic, oh my gosh, I'm so embarrassed. And I'm drinking this Arden's Garden juice. It's like a detox, so that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, so I'm gonna just take off the polish on these right now. This is actually regular polish, but I did put a gel top coat, so I am gonna have to like soak them a little bit. And these I get on Amazon, so I just got a bunch of these to soak off my nails. So I just finished my nails. I wanted to show you guys what they look like. I decided to do this little design. I just finished doing filming two videos. I did um, my powder foundation routine and then I also did a fun tag that you guys probably already saw. But I'm done with filming for today. So excited because that was definitely the biggest task to do today. I also had to finish up um, emailing back a brand that I'm working with. I have a couple sponsorships that's going on this month. I'm a little bit hungry. I have been drinking this detox. This is from Arden's Garden. And it's from, um, they're located in Atlanta. And I ordered these online. So they came in the mail. And they actually don't taste that bad. It's like a two-day detox of drinking just that so that's what i'm doing today yes yeah, it's, it's rough girl <laughs> 
Oh, I did get an order from Abercrombie and Fitch. I actually ordered a few things. I got these jeans. These are skinny, high rise, curved love jeans. This is the line that's made for people who are more curvy. This is a long sleeve um, Henley top. Then I got this top. This is a, actually it's a bodysuit. So it's a bodysuit with a v-neck in the front and the back. And it has some buttons here, which you can unbutton. I think it's gonna look really nice. And then I also got this um, short sleeve. Then these feel amazing, by the way. Like the material is so good. And then I got this. This is a t-shirt and they did tie it for me. Like, where is it? Right here, it came tied like that. It's from the Soft um, Collection. I got a regular tank top also from this collection. If it, the, the Soft, this collection called the Soft Collection feels amazing. And then I got um, this tank top with lace detailing. And then this is another thing from the soft and drapey collection, which also feels amazing. As you can see, I got a lot of white, creamy, and like nude clothes because that's kind of what I'm into lately. I've just been really into that vibe. I do need to go to the Apple store eventually today. I don't know what time I'm gonna go. Um, but I do need to go because I want to get a new laptop. I want to look at the MacBook Pro because my laptop is perfectly fine except one of the most important things I needed for in YouTube. And it's my, the USB port is very loose. So every time I put my hard drive in there, it drops out. So while I'm editing, it's continuously dropping out like every five minutes. And it takes me so long to edit videos because every time it drops out of my computer, the hard drive disappears and then it takes me like a good three minutes for it to pop up back on the screen. So it's like such a long process unnecessarily that I'm over it. The other one is damaged because I accidentally tried to shove headphones into it thinking it was the headphone jack. <laughs> but so yeah, I need to get a new MacBook because this is annoying. Also, let me show you guys a little um, beauty supply store haul because I went there yesterday. Um, this is some stuff I got. I got these for my daughter. This is from Curls and it's the So So, let me show you guys like this. It's the So So Smooth um, Vitamin Collection. And I got this little nail polish thing so I can do my nails. I got a black one also. I also got this curl control paste from Curls. I actually really, really love this a lot. And I use this for my daughter. I got a couple brushes. I have this one. This is a soft one. I also have a hard one for myself. Um, I have a comb that I opened already. But you guys, they have this beautiful like um, beige combs. And I definitely love them. So I got two... I love this color. Then I got the foot scrub from Barefoot. It's from Freeman. And I'm going to use this to scrub my feet. <laughs> and um, and I figured I would get one of those Pumi bars as well to help scrub my feet. I definitely miss going to the beauty supply store. That's one of the things I miss during this whole experience. And there's one next to my job. So I got all these things at that store. Where I live, we don't really have use supply stores like that it's more like sally's i love sally's though i love sally's but it's not a beauty supply store it's sally's okay anyways i'm gonna go get something to eat well not really i'm gonna go drink something <laughs> and i'll talk to you guys a little bit later hey y'all so um it's a few hours later i'm actually outside because it's actually really nice today um you guys can probably hear the birds and then you can probably hear my dad banging on something he's fixing up um He's doing a little bit of construction in the sunroom. Ooh, it is really nice, except for the bugs out here. So I wanted to show you guys, I just got a package from Sephora, so I wanted to open it up and show you guys what's in there. All right, so this is what's in here besides the knife, obviously, but I got some stuff from Patrick Ta. I got a uh, blush. I also got, oh, sorry. I also got his brow product. I also got a lipstick. I got a lip liner. And then I got this new Makeup Forever um, Matte Velvet Skin Concealer, which I'm really excited to try this out. So I'm definitely excited to try this. This is the blush hair. The packaging looks amazing. And how do you open this? So this is the inside. It's a cream blush. So you have a cream. Well, it has cream. This has cream and powder. So you have two. Um, blush options 
So my camera's gonna die. I'll show you guys the other stuff in a video because I definitely need to charge my battery. Good morning guys, welcome to another day in the live. Today is Sunday, it's super early, it's like seven o'clock in the morning. But we had to get up really early today because we're going on a little adventure. Um, not really, we're going to Manhattan to go to the Apple store because my laptop is not working properly. But we're gonna go super early, that way we can get there and be in and out of the city because it's not a place that I like to be. Um, especially during these times. So I have my outfit. I'm wearing, I'm wearing this headband. This is, I showed you guys this in my last haul. This is from, um, Target. I'm wearing this top from American Eagle. And then I'm wearing this skirt that I showed you guys in the haul as well. This is my entire haul, basically. My hair is from Bella Meads. These are clip-in extensions. And then I'm wearing my Neverfull from Louis Vuitton. I'm probably just gonna wear, like, either Vans or my Rothy's with this outfit. So again, we will. And it's setting. Woo -hoo. Here we go. Do it. Hey guys, all right, hey y'all. So we just got done um, getting the laptop. We are currently in the car, we just got back to the car. We walked five blocks, but Manhattan blocks are crazy, so I'm sweating. <laughs> We're passing near my high school, you guys. I haven't been here in forever. This is Lincoln Stadium, wait, no, Lincoln Center. This is where I graduated at, Lincoln Center, right in there. And then my high school is on 66th Street, I think. Um, it's in this street right here. What is this? 65th Street. I can never remember which street it was on. It's on 50, 65th Street. Down this block. Hi, high school. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so nostalgic. There used to be a Barnes and Nobles right here, where there's Century 21. The Starbucks is around the corner. Um, a lot of things are the same. This was the Gap. Oh no, the Gap is right here. One day, I had my cycle, and I had to come get underwear at the Gap. <laughs> I, had to be I don't know what at this spot right here, but I bet it looks so cool. I kind of want to go. Like right now. I think it's close, but it looks cool, like right. my vibe. Okay. Well, you can always, you can always mark it down. Okay. We're on 75th Street. I'm going to show you guys the laptop that I got. I got the MacBook Pro. I haven't had a Pro in a few years. I actually had one, and then I switched to the Air. And I went back to the Pro because I feel like it's better for editing. So I missed it. So that's what I got. This one is different because it doesn't have an SD card slot anymore. I haven't my mac that i have right now has an sd card slot and it also doesn't have a usb regular drive it has a usb c which is these tiny things here um so i'm gonna have to get like a separate accessory for it which is ridiculous but whatever um yeah i'm excited it has a touch bar as well which i don't know if i'm gonna i'll probably use it but to me it seems so foreign that it's like seems complicated right now but i'll probably end up using it we were just talking about like how it's impossible to get lost in manhattan if you guys don't live in new york um manhattan is like so easy to navigate like you either go north south east or west and like going north the streets just go north like you just count them as you go up so 92 93 94 and then once you know the cross streets you're pretty much set so like it's literally long streets that run through the whole city and once you figure out the order of them like you're good except for like maybe uptown like in like washington heights or like even parts of maybe harlem it might be a little different and then all the way in the bottom like near soho the streets kind of you know change and a little different but for the most part it's so easy to navigate in and setting up the uh, computer add in final cut pro because that's what i need <laughs> and yeah mm -hmm. still in the car though so we just stopped at Starbucks. We did have Starbucks earlier, but um, we need some more coffee because honestly, I barely slept last night and Johnny didn't sleep much either. But um, 
so yeah we're at starbucks johnny's inside getting the drinks and i'm trying to set up the computer i have it on my lap here i'm using my phones i'm trying to use starbucks wi-fi to set this up and right now i am downloading google chrome because that's what i prefer to use over safari i'm trying to download it but it's like not giving me the option that's like the most important thing i do not want to buy final cut pro over like no girl it's not happening today is saturday it's another saturday but today i've been so productive i actually filmed three videos already and i have one more to do for today but basically i need to get some videos out the way because i'm getting my brows done this week and i'm not able to apply makeup for a whole week so i definitely want to be ahead of my schedule a little bit so i plan to do three today and three tomorrow um in terms of videos um i honestly i just made a huge mess on my desk so i need to clean that up i have one more video in mind to film today but i'm not really sure if i'm gonna go ahead and do it but basically i want to rearrange my makeup because i just want to be able to have i want to rearrange my makeup a little bit and um kind of do a little bit of decluttering so i think i'm gonna film that and show you guys because i know some of y'all want to see those types of videos not everybody loves decluttering but some people do i don't know i sometimes do it is definitely refreshing to kind of just get rid of old things and things that you don't use so i might do that um yeah that's what i'm up to today it's been a long week because i worked all week at my nursing job and now i'm working once more on the weekend so that's my life y'all that's how i kind of juggle you know this whole thing since i have a full-time job i do have to juggle both jobs which can be very stressful it can be pretty difficult <laughs> but it's what i gotta do you know to basically keep this boat afloat i just got an upload in a video and i am about to edit after i edited a video <laughs> for a brand that i'm working with and then um now i was trying to edit another video for tuesday i'm right now in my sunroom um which is the back room it's kind of like we're transitioning it into a playroom for the kids so right here is like all their toys and then um we want to make the other portion an area where we can lounge and it's a pretty decent sized room um it was just junk in here to be honest it's not insulated so we don't really use it during the winter but during summer um spring and fall it is definitely usable um so yeah we're redoing it my husband johnny painted it white it was uh, previously a dark brown color and he painted it white over the past couple weeks it looks really good y'all like it looked so bad before now it looks amazing and he also did these boards with my dad these are all they have all their toys here i literally cleaned this like an hour ago and they came and made a mess again y'all yeah the other side is full of junk i don't even want to show y'all but we are going to eventually clear out the junk <laughs> i'm just embarrassed at the junk i'm looking at it and i'm like do i want to show y'all this junk right now i don't know but in through here is my living room this is my little workstation for right now um, i was sitting here working while the kids were playing and they left me to watch to watch a movie and then we have to sort through all of this stuff so eventually this section will be usable but for now it's like completely junk and then um over here is where the kids stuff let me try let me stand all right let me stand like all the way here so you guys can get a better idea so this is the kids section here i have a fan in here because it was a little hot earlier it's actually pretty cool now and then um this is where i was sitting this one of their um easels and then over here is the area full of junk <laughs> that i need to clean and eventually have a table and um just a couple chairs right here so that way we can kind of lounge and then we have like a little bookshelf going on right here so yeah we're just trying to make it usable because it was previously just it all looked like this previously like the whole room was full of junk like that these are all lights i used to use and they're actually still good so i don't really want to throw them out i think i'm going to put them up on like i don't know i don't know what to do with them i don't really want to ship them anywhere so hopefully i can find someone who is in need of lights i don't know 